GG Gamer here, and today we're back with more TCG openings. Today we're doing something new, something different, going into my favorite manga anime series from back when I was a kid. We're hopping into 2004 era of upper deck cards and opening Shaman King Reincarnation Booster Packs. Stick around, hang out, let's see what's going on inside these bad boys, see what these cards are about, what the set's all about. We're gonna take a look, see what the shinies look like, what the cards look like, and what's just going on with these bad boys. Stick around, 14 packs to open, so I hope you guys enjoy. Please hit like and subscribe, help the channel and the video, and uh, let's just get to it, see what's going on. Alright, so let's hop into opening some packs here. As you can see, I have my Shaman King incomplete set here it's uh oh no as you can see i have my uh, shaman king manga set here i believe there's like what 10 more or 11 more i need to get they are actually skyrocketing in value right now it's pretty pretty crazy but if you don't know anything about the manga it's done by hiro yuki take um serialized in shonen jump from 98 to i believe in about 2004 and then was relaunched as ebooks in 2018, which got published in 2020. Um, out of all these, there's yeah, 32 volumes. They were released in America in 2003, 2004. Over, I believe it was from the, some of the research I did, over 38 million of these um, manga sold by uh, March 2021, so that's worldwide numbers. They actually did an anime TV series too, and I believe it was like 2001, 2002, where it was like 64 episodes. Super awesome, I loved them. Definitely recommend if you haven't seen or read any of this, highly recommend you go check it out. And they actually just re-licensed it in America, so we're gonna see a relaunch of this stuff going on. But yeah, these cards are done by Upper Deck, and um, yeah, so let's take a look, see what's going on, and uh, I guess there's a reboot happening actually like this month uh, via TV Tokyo, so let's hop in and kind of get a look at some of these cards to see what's going on. All right, hopping into the first pack here, we got a Pounce, that looks kind of cool. Now, just doing these for opening purposes and having fun. Uh, Pokemon's kind of hard to get right now, so we're going to take a break on that. Um, I just can't afford them. I uh, just got an actually job interview, so we'll see how that goes. Maybe I can start doing some more soon. That's a really cool card. I like that. Um, oh, hi. Hey. Anna, hi, 1080 Flash. That's pretty cool. Big Bill. But yeah, so I think there's probably two more videos I can do for sure for the Pokemon TCG openings. Um, until I can get some more money to get some more cards. Um, so expect, uh, probably a box to come in. Oh, that's really cool. Lola. What is this? What the heck? You like, pop that out? Oh, yeah. What is this? That's interesting. Oh, shoot. Whoa. That is pretty cool. Look at that. That is interesting. It's like dual-sided, too. That is pretty cool, Lola. Shooting star. It has a little skateboard here. Let me. I'll just zoom in onto it with the effect. How cool is that? Flip it over. What an interesting little card. Up and down like that. Nice. We'll put that up there since that's that seems to be like the unique one. Um, but yeah, so. We're gonna hop into some more of these. These were done by Upper Deck, which is really cool. Um, Upper Deck's pretty well known uh, trading card brand for collecting collectible cards and stuff like that. And I do have more of these, so we're, we could definitely do more of these. I just kind of want to take a look at them and see what's going on. I'm keeping some for my collection. Um, I believe each pack's only like four bucks, so. Flamboyant Arrival. Broom Corn Beatdown. That doesn't look like fun. Okay, let's take a look at the back real quick. How cool is that? I wonder if they all have like the same back. Let's see. Now, I don't actually know how to play this game, but I just really love Shaman King. And so uh, I figured why not outnumbered. Look at that. We got all the boys there. All the boys. That's pretty cool. Vinster. 
<clears throat> Sylvia. Oh, so cool. Silva, my bad. Zeke. Zeke. Purity of mine with Anna. Oh, yo. I <laughs> get it. Yo. It's a yo. And look at that. Oh, my God. That is so cool. Aminamaru. It's been a while since I read the manga and watched the shows and all that. So, please do forgive me as I am, uh, you know, still kind of uh, rusty on some of these names and stuff. That is so cool, though. Wow, hell yeah, I'm happy. I'm happy with that. We got our boy. We got the boy. All right, opening another one. Let's see, these are pretty cool. I gotta say, I think these cards are pretty unique. I like the little style they got there with those big boys. I wonder like what's the the big one. Baron Justice, Necro Awakening, hell no, zombies, no thank you. Precognition. <laughs> I believe that's his grandpa or his dad or something like that. Or at least his sensei for sure. Seismic Eruption. June. Purity of Mine. Hmm. Talesman Warrior. Lil... Lil... Lala. Lil... Lala. Lizard. And, oh, the big boy Lizard. Let's see. Ooh, how cool is that? These are interesting little cards. I definitely like how they have that little extra little boom there. It's so just intriguing. That is interesting. So it's like a dual-sided card. I wonder how these are played in the game. Oop, that one's tough to get back in there. So there we go. I believe these are like the cool, like the, the big cards. They're very interesting to say the least. I mean, I, I've never seen cards like this before. I've played Magic, I've played Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh. Um, I play a lot of trading card games, and let's just say I've never seen anything like that. Director's Cut, Fetish Frenzy, Rebuking Blade, oof, oof. Does not look uh, like it's good news right there. Uh, thorough Schooling, gotta get that education in. June, Epicenter, Punchy Punch, Reposition, Ward Off, and another Lizer. Let's see, is it the same? Big Ben Blitz, and Homing Pendulum. Here we go, let's see. <clears throat> Dowsing, yeah, yeah, so it looks like two different attacks there. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, that's interesting. And they're both the, the same on the back. So, let's just... Oh, my lord. All right, a little bit of an adjustment there. <laughs> but, yeah, so it looks like you get same card, but different little attacking abilities there. This wouldn't be a GG Gamer video without stuff falling over, right? I mean, just own it and keep rocking with it. But these are pretty cool. Never seen cards like these before. Definitely uh, interesting. Fetus Frenzy. Flamboyant Arrival, Honing Blades, Wrath of the Prisoner, that looks pretty wild. Point Blank, Silva, Ooh. Ward Off, such a savage, such a savage. Desolate Screams, and AGN. Let's see if we can pull this up. These are really hard to pull up sometimes. Cage of Pentance. Penitence. That's a wild looking card. Maiden Voyage. Very cool. That is wild. Alright. Man, those are tough to push back in. And we'll continue on. Let's go. So, yeah, I grew up watching Shaman King and then uh, a friend of mine back in early days put me onto it. And so I just started reading the mangas and all that. And yeah, I have almost the full thing, I think, right there. And now I just need to finish up the set. Shattering Palm, Seismic Eruption, Flamboyant Arrival, Manifestation of Power, Maddie, oops. Yo, me. <laughs> yep. As you can see, Asakura Patriarch, 
he is part of Yo's um, training. I believe it's his grandpa. Um, 10 more sit-ups. <laughs> and another Lizer. Ooh, this is different too. A whole nother one. So there's definitely lots of different abilities you can get up here. This is Exterminate now. And this is different too on the back. So it looks like you can get two different kind of things, variations going on. How cool is that? Nice, wow. So Lizer, lots of Lizer is happening right now. But what's interesting is lots of different versions of that card. Some interesting stuff I did learn while researching this card, you know, game and whatnot, because I was curious about it. Because, you know, me, I just watched, I actually watched a documentary recently because there are a lot of uh, Reeves boots are happening for the Shaman King franchise right now just because they're so ahead of their time and they're doing new stuff. Um, but they actually, um, this didn't really go too crazy. Like this card game didn't kind of branch out and get too big because of partially, mostly um, due to Blockbuster. <laughs> um, oh wow, Duncan. That's kind of cool. Okay, very cool, very cool. Oh. That was weird on this side. That's interesting. Okay, very cool. But yeah, because of Blockbuster, actually this, they are one of the, pretty much one of the main reasons why this card set didn't do too well and why it was canceled. Um, and by that, I mean, it was, canceled due to underperformance because Blockbuster had exclusive rights to the game and like the video game itself that they were releasing at that time. And so um, it underperformed and Upper Deck couldn't really do anything um, else with the set because of those exclusive rights. And so due to that, um, the game kind of tanked and so did this card set kind of thing. So it actually was canceled because of Blockbuster having exclusive rights, which I thought was kind of interesting. Um, and so, I don't know, I just love this. I love cards, opening packs and stuff, and I love Shaman King. So I figured what the hell, let's do it. And um, yeah, I bought some packs and I uh, thought I'd another Lizer. I think we got this one before, yeah. So another Eliza. Looks like this might be a common pull. Um, I wonder if it's actually any good, to be honest. Because if so, but there's four of them right there. <laughs> All right, we're coming into the last bit of packs there. What do we got? Five left, six with this in my hand. So we're gonna open these up and then call it a day. And then hopefully by this week, or by next Monday, I'll have half a box of battle styles to open. And the Monday after that, I will be opening the rest of the battle styles. Um, and then we'll go from there. Uh, I think there's gonna be some slowing down with the Pokemon card openings just because it's hard to find. And again, I'm unemployed, so it's hard to buy as well for me. But I enjoy doing it, so it's kind of, you know, a passion I'd like to keep, keep on uh, continuing with, but you know. I gotta make sure I get rent in and stuff like that first. <laughs> uh, another one. I think this one's different. Here, let me see if I can. Cyclone a petition. Yeah, so. See, this one doesn't have that backside, which is interesting. Is that a mess up? I think I got a mess up card. Anywho, yeah, that's the same on this side. But then we flip it over and we're missing <laughs> that little guy right there. But it's different, so. That's cool. All right, so yeah, we got a mess up card. Woo, mess up card, hey. Watch this be like a fake set and not even like the real card set and I'm just opening some like bullshit. <laughs> Have a buff. I wouldn't be mad because it's Sean King and I still think they're really cool, but I definitely be like, well, you got me because I have no idea about this card set like at all. This is just a blind opening. Enjoying the opening. Enjoying the artwork, you know, just enjoying the lore. Cause I love Shaman King. So that looks pretty cool. Look at that one. All right. Yeah, I'm pretty stoked that they're doing like a revamp and you know, our boy Take is getting some love again because yes, let's go. This is one of the ones I was hoping to pull. So my favorite character, one of my favorite characters is Len Ren. Um, let's open this up real quick. Oh man, that's so cool. 
Oh, it's red and blue. How cool is that? Yes. Sky to the ground, power down. That's pretty cool. I love that. Hell yeah, let's go. Let's see if we can get that back in there. Pew! All right. So, we're gonna hop over to this pack. And then we got a couple more videos. I have a job interview later today, so we'll see how that goes. Dynamic Slice. Seismic Eruption. Mystic Beam. Oh, a holographic. Hey, Captivate. Look at that. So we have our first shiny. How cool is that? I wonder if I can actually sleeve this up. There we go. I didn't know there was holographics in here, but hey, I'll take it. That is our first, uh, first big shiny pull there. How cool is that? Nice. There we go. Hop back into this. Oops. Oh, that looks gnarly. Thug life. <laughs> Look at that card. Thug life. Uh, oh, and a Matty. Okay. Let's see if I can. This is kind of hard to do. Some of these just don't want to come up. My lord. Come on. <laughs> no, it didn't want to freaking come out, and I barely even forced that. What the? F oh, one card run. I figured this was gonna happen at least once. So there we go. Oh well, at least it's only one of them. <laughs> Slice and dice. That's actually cool. I wish this card didn't just get ruined, but it's all good because. Look at that, oh, that artwork's so cool. Oh man, oh well. This girl actually kind of reminds me of my girlfriend because she's born on Halloween and she kind of she kind of looks like her a little bit, just a little bit. <laughs> I destroyed that card for sure. <laughs> I look like nothing happened. I don't know what happened. All right, hopping into some of these now. Last couple packs, let's see. Oh, that's cool, 1080 flash. And it is a beast. Wreck Precognition, Kana. Ooh, that's cool, Dark Ascendance. Joko, Reposition, Feral Instinct, and Alola, how cool is that? Very cool, we'll open up the back, another one. So let's see, we definitely got another Lola. We are gonna loosen it up a little bit. I'm trying to get it up. Dude, these are stuck in there. I'm gonna ruin this one. Oh, there we go. So if you just shake it a little bit, it actually loosens it up. There we go. Shooting the star. Yeah, hand plant. Barrage. Barrage, my bad. Barrage. That's pretty cool. She's a cool character. There we go. And we have two packs left, and that is everything. So I'm gonna move those in a little bit here. We got a shiny today, which is very cool. Not the only shiny. Alright, let's see. Shattering Palm, Razor's Edge, Seismic Eruption. Rogue Shot, oops, Mob Mentality, Elizerg, Epicenter, Point Blank, Mickey Hasa, and another Lola. Oh, this one comes right out. Beautiful. Good Night Kiss, that's new. So that's a new one. And yeah, Hand Plant Barrage again. But that's definitely a new one up there. So that's pretty cool. There we go, let's see. And then we are on our last pack. You know what, and we didn't actually really look at the artwork on the pack, so I'm gonna do this real quick. Let's take a look at this artwork. As you see, we have Yo and Admit tomorrow. What the back looks like. And I noticed that all these have the same little code right here, since it's the upper deck code. So they should all be 53334-34449. And uh, yeah, so that's what the back looks like. See nothing under there. Should pop up easily. Boom, boom, boom. The little glue dots right there from this. 
and then yeah so upper deck 10 cards per pack there you guys go so yeah in case you're looking to buy some that's what the pack should look like um and they should uh should be pretty pretty fun i'll be honest shared purpose fetish frenzy ancient discipline thorough schooling consuming hatred hey maddie point blank joko talon and Ooh, Zeke, look at this. That is pretty cool. Let's see if I can pump, get this open. There we go. Elemental transmutation. That is pretty dang cool. And then of course, auth author's insight. Nice, that is pretty rad. So we'll go ahead and take a look at today's big polls again real quick here. All right, so Captivate, our only shiny today. Very beautiful card like that one a lot we have the zeke choo, choo, choo. lola we got three of those then we have maddie pumpkin girl i think that's the one i destroyed duncan and another duncan we have gian very cool i think this is one of my other favorites right here besides you of course Oh, I really like the dynamics of this card. Uh, the both the moons have the yin yang. Yo, very chill, very hit, very cool dude. Eliza, four of those. So yeah, those were today's polls. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I really appreciate it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed opening those boosters. Stay tuned for next week. Next Monday, I believe we will be back to Pokemon. We got a box coming for that. We're gonna do half a box for one video and then the other half for another. And uh, yeah, so thank you guys. Much love, later.